Hey everybody, it's Jim from Cigar, Cigar, Cigars. Today I am reviewing the Fuente Fuente Opus X. And as you're well aware, this is a special occasion cigar. But I figured I'm on top of the grass looking down from the green side today. That's a special occasion, so we'll call it good. And it's a perfect excuse to have an Opus X. A little bit about the Opus X. It's been around way back since 1995. And prior to that time, the word on the street was you couldn't grow wrapper tobacco in the Dominican Republic. But the Fuente family got a hold of some Cuban Corojo seeds and used them to grow successfully wrapper for the Opus X. And it still is, to the best of my knowledge, the only Dominican Puro that exists. In other words, it's all Dominican Republic tobacco. So if you're at all familiar with the Opus X, you know that there's a lot of different versions of it available. Today I'm going to be smoking just the classic Opus X, but I'm going to need my notes for this. this these are just some of the other versions of the Opus X available. We have the classic Lost City, Oro Oscuro, Angel Share, Forbidden, Heaven and Earth, Perfection, Opus X 20th, and then a whole bunch of limited editions. I was just reading one that came out in August of 2023, a special edition, and I believe it was 102 Opus X cigars in a very limited edition, specially designed humidor, and the price tag on that, if you're interested for a Christmas present, is $11,000. So I don't, think, I don't think I'm going to be finding that under my tree, but maybe you're luckier than me. I'm going to get this cut and lit up and be back in a minute. I got this Opus X lit up and I wanted to make a couple of comments about the appearance in general. There are some veins and so forth that you can see creating some bumps in the wrapper. It's not really, I wouldn't describe it as toothy, but it, it, it isn't perfectly smooth either. So it's an interesting wrapper, but one thing I can tell you for sure, this is going to be a pretty strong cigar, very full bodied. So I'm going to smoke this up and get back to you in a little while with a full report. I'm far enough along in this Fuente Fuente Opus X to make a final report. And I got to tell you, it is a very unique cigar. Very seldom do I separate body from strength because most of the time they go hand in hand. But in this particular case, this cigar is really up there in terms of strength. But in terms of body, it's it actually smokes a lot like a medium body cigar. And it has a great flavor profile that you'd expect in a medium body cigar. Nutty, I'm gonna say cashews, and actually dried fruit. It's kind of interesting, not sweet, a little bit sweet, but not very much. And then with a little taste of caramel once in a while too. So great taste, wonderful taste. I love a medium bodied cigar with that flavor profile and this fits the bill. In terms of construction, as you can see, absolutely no problems. Draw is wonderful on it, it's perfect. Not too easy, not too hard by any means. And the burn has been straight along, straight edge all the way through. Let's start out with, with strength and body. I'm gonna give this, in terms of strength and body, I gotta say eight and a half. We'll kind of split the difference between the strength and the body since I separated them out. It certainly started out very strong though, but it did settle in nicely as well. I wanted to point something else out too, and that is the band on this cigar. This is probably the, as I was smoking it, I was admiring the band, and I'll show a picture of it, but it's one of the more ornate bands I've ever seen in terms of just a lot of embossing and, and, um, a lot of effort put into making this band special. And as I understand it, the Fuentes are a little bit concerned about counterfeiting. In fact, what I've read is Carlo Fuente himself, when he smokes an Opus X, he tears up the band because he's so afraid of leaving bands around for counterfeiters. So I'm not gonna tear up this band. We'll keep, we'll keep this one. In terms of overall smoking experience, this is one of those special cigars. It really is a good cigar. And I can understand all the hubbub about it over the years. But anyway, I'm going to finish this up and enjoy it. But man, if, if you're up to it and it's special occasion cigar, Opus X is something to try. One of the many versions. All right. See you next time.